track clear already so in this tutorial we're going to make a full session piano and um, i'm going to make sure i'm taking the beat as we go on i'll try my best not promising anything as i begin this is what i'm going i'm going to make a full drum i'm going to do my drum start with my drum so bear with me all right so the next thing is i always like to start with my bass because once i get my bass like um i know like um, what i'm going to do so when it comes to bass i've discovered this space and uh, i'm going to share my tricks and tips on this how i do it so stick around i'm going to change my scale here i'm going to use d i hope you ha you know my you know how to use the scales guys if you know how to remove these grids ne? if you know how to remove the grids just drop the comment because ish I don't know what happened. I don't know what I pressed, but hey, this team doesn't want to go. Hey, doesn't want. But yeah, so help me out, guys. Anyways, yeah, let's get into this. Okay, so we hit a second pattern to get the bass. So you see what I did is just repeat the same thing and then I just change somewhere here. So really like this bass line you just need to repeat like have a, s a sound repeating in your head and then just like dum 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 yeah like that's what I that's what I do when I don't know how to, to make a bass. So yeah and then uh, for me what I do when I make my pads I don't do it like other producers which they like you see if you make a pad sound one like this look at this. If your pet just sounds like this, like this, look how boring it's going to sound when it's like this. You see, but look at me what I do. I add some like this. So my pad is in the wrong layer. Place it in the third layer and uh, something like that.
tutorials on how, how what you can do what you can do so that you you get the you get the right sound like like the how to make melodies i gave a tutorial but i'm going to do another one here now and just show you what i do when i go about making my melodies so you wanna make sure it's full yeah right then you wanna make sure so i want to change it because i'm going for like a pet type stuff so i'm gonna go here then i'm gonna go to mp preset these are my presets guys make sure you download them yeah. so make sure you download them and let's see sounds good but i'm looking for a dark stuff yes. you see like this one this one it even says use eq for the low so you wanna get the low because you see if it plays ne? you see that low is there so i don't want it to sound there so you use eq do this because it's sounding harsh i'm gonna put it down like this and then i'm gonna make it come up. so what i used to do back then like if i've got two melodies for example i made a melody like this here so if it's together like this i'm gonna look where there's white notes and, do, and place them like that so you see here i place them here if it sounds good i leave then if it doesn't i'm gonna change <laughs> Now let's go up here and see. Oh, I'm gonna do it. going to try and okay okay <laughs>
like um yeah they they pair <laughs> The next one I get is like um, something that's gonna repeat like ting 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 ting. <laughs> yeah, normally, yeah. Let me see if this will work. noise and make it smaller <laughs> then let me try to send the sound try to hear this one and share it yeah this name so we'll get another <laughs> So I come here to master and make sure that this is all um, changed it, replaced it with the clipper. That's my first rule. Then I make sure uh, if you come to my log drum preset, uh, I, and I use this one. Then I'm going to transfer it. Then uh, what I do now is like just add. It's easy, guys. Yo, the way I do this, guys, anybody can anybody can hit the log drum hard. No offense, producers. No offense, no offense, no offense, Kabza. But yeah, we can do it. <laughs> Control V. And then yeah, what we do here now? Listen. <laughs> now I'm going to put the bass off, and then I'm going to put this bass off, and then just focus on this log drum. Yeah, I'm going to show you what I do when I'm making my log drum. You see, I copied this bass. I copied it. I'm copying it again. I'm pushing it off, and I'm going to paste it where my log drum is. You see, I paste it here where my log drum is. So when I paste it like that. So I paste it where my log drum is. I copied the wrong thing. I'm going to copy this base. Copy. Then I'm going to paste it where my log drum is. Then it sounds like this. <laughs> sounds dry né? but the first step is to make sure that it's like this it's like this it's like this it's like this let's make it small then now let's make it bouncy <laughs>
simple melody so I can yeah. small then what i could if you didn't understand what i thought just hit me up in the comment tell me what you didn't understand tell me what, did, what you didn't get i'll explain it yeah and if you have any suggestion for any tutorial you want me to do on what mastering a beat whatever it is mastering vocals yeah i'm going to do it actually 